Uh, it's actually uh, wine, empty wine bottles that we were had ordered five or six months ago and we waited on. And the guy was following me to our warehouse in North Mankato and flipped the curb, it looked like. And I, I was right in front of him. I could just see it happen. And it just teeter tottered and flipped over. And luckily, the driver's alive and looked like he's in he's okay shape. So uh, I don't have much hope up to see if there's anything left to salvage here, but we'll find out. out how much it, it weighs exactly and whether we can roll it up loaded or if we have to unload it. With this being a container trailer, it takes a little more weight than a regular trailer does. Once we determine how much it weighed, we just determine that we can just roll it up without unloading it. And we hooked up um, our cables to the top side so we're actually producing lift as we're pulling it, so it's kind of lifting it and pulling it at the same time. And you just keep pulling and it just eventually will come over. I think you can see in the video that it didn't come slamming down because when it's loaded, they tend to settle slower than if they're empty. For, okay. I'm not sure the reason, but they do. Now when you start lifting it, the front end of your tow truck goes up. It Explain come, that. Yep, it did come up and it was just because of my boom is high and I'm pulling down and it's like a teeter-totter. It, it went up and as soon as it started to come up and I got to a point then the front end settled down and then it was just a matter of, of pulling it. How scary is that with, as a driver? I mean, Well, it's always in the back of your mind. Uh, you know, if, if anything breaks, the chain breaks, the cable breaks, anything breaks. It, has to buy, you know, it's terrible you know okay. you know your truck can roll over things go flying it's yeah i've never had it happen and i never wanted to 
Well, good job, John. I appreciate that. Thank you. Ha, ha, ha.